let's start with manpower. A constant stream of manpower is generated from your headquarters and from the total number of territory sectors you control. The first number in the highlighted area shows the total amount of manpower you currently have. The second number shows how much manpower you are earning per minute. Munitions is the second resource. You spend munitions to upgrade your squads and use special abilities like throwing grenades. A constant stream of munitions is generated by capturing munitions sectors such as this one. Fuel is the final resource and is spent to deploy heavy vehicles, base structures, and to purchase global upgrades. A constant stream of fuel is generated by capturing fuel sectors like this one. The mini-map shows the location of all resource points. To get a more detailed view of the battlefield, click on the flashing button to bring up the tactical map. This is the tactical map. The battlefield is divided up into a number of territory sectors. Each sector has an icon which represents the location of the strategic point and the type of resource it provides. The more sectors you control, the more manpower you will receive. To return to the game view, click on the exit button and we'll capture a sector. Select your rifleman squad. Right-click on the munitions point to capture it. Taking ammo, depot. Right-click on the munitions point to capture it. Able Good. You've captured the point. the point, and now you control the territory sector. As you can see on the mini-map, the sector is now blue, indicating it is allied territory. However, the sector is also flashing. This means it is out of supply, and you are not receiving resources from it. Bring up the tactical map to get a better understanding of supply lines. The munitions sector you've just captured is here. As you can see, it's not connected to your HQ sector here. This means it is out of supply. Out of supply territories do not generate any resources. To bring the munitions sector into supply, you need to capture this connecting sector. Double click on the strategic point symbol to zoom in on that location. Sometimes the enemy will be defending strategic points. Eliminate the enemy, then capture the strategic point. Sometimes the enemy will be defending strategic points. Eliminate the enemy, then capture the strategic point. Enemy unit down. Oh, we'll take it all right. Sometimes the enemy will be defending strategic points. Eliminate the enemy. Excellent. Strategic points are vital in establishing your front lines and territory. Now, let's return to the munition sector. The munition sector is now in supply and generating a constant stream of resources. The resources a sector generates is indicated on its icon. Notice this matches your current munitions rate on the taskbar. Now, we need to secure the munitions sector to increase your munitions intake and make it harder for the enemy to capture. Now click on the flashing field defenses button on the command panel. Left click on the observation post button and then left click on the munitions point. Me, I'd rather dig than get my ass shot off. Okay, now that the really. observation post is complete, the sector is secure. Notice that your munitions rate has increased. 
More importantly, the enemy will need to destroy your observation post before they can capture your sector. This area is crawling with German patrols. Time to defend our front lines.